I set up a lot of kinds of track around the house for my kid, but today these tracks are for race cars. That's right, we're diving into Hot Wheels today. Setting up different kinds of track around the house has been a lot of fun, and it's great to explore the different kinds of ways that these go together versus our train tracks and such. But we've also been linking up a lot of cool Hot Wheels City kind of tracks. These have bases that have interlocking uh, sections that allow you to connect them not just to other Hot Wheels track, but to other bits of the city. That modular aspect of how these go together has been really fun to explore, not just for Colin because of what I've managed to set up, but for me as a dad, it's interesting for me to be able to explore different possibilities and different layouts to have fun with so it's not the same setup every time. The Hot Wheels City also has lots of fun little gimmicks for him to explore and to understand mechanics a little bit more and see how things work. It's been fun watching him interact with this stuff and Whoa. i would be lying if I'm i wasn't already. also admittedly having a good time My head is bigger. for those with a keen eye you may have noticed a lot of subarus around our hot wheels city and that's admittedly my fault not only do i collect diecast subarus um and have quite a few of them i also follow subaru motorsports usa quite closely and i've had a great time doing all that but more than that I've got a couple of Subarus myself, and Colin loves these, especially the blue one. And so that means when I get wind that there's a Gymkhana car in town, we get to go check out his heroes that he's been watching on the screen. Colin, what do you think, buddy? That's pretty, you saw that on TV, right? Now it's here in person. We were both admittedly pretty stoked to see the family Huckster in person, and it's been really fun having our own little kind of Gymkhana type adventures around our Hot Wheels city. It's also been neat linking together the Matchbox city stuff with Hot Wheels stuff because all of the bases are actually the same. I was surprised to wow. find this because I'm from the area where Matchbox and Hot Wheels are kind of competitors, but now they're owned by the same people. So it's all good and things work together. And it just means that there's more variety to what we can add to our city. It isn't all a flawless fit. Sometimes you have to get a little creative with how you put things together. For instance, the Hot Wheels City track sections are different lengths than the actual traditional Hot Wheels tracks are. So getting things to fit together can be a little bit tricky, but it's all worked out pretty well and it's still a lot of fun. When he's all done, it's easy enough to pick up and load into a tote. And then the next time he wants to play with Hot Wheels, set things up a different way so we can have different experiences every time. Well, that's it for now. So thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and we'll see you on the next one.